Orange One here, so we are going to be jumping into the wonderful world of Cyberpunk. And I'm not just going to start the game at the beginning, because I feel like everyone's done that, and I want to show you some kind of mid-late game stuff right away. So I've got this, like, hacker build character. Um, we're just kind of in the middle of the city. I want to show you what's, like, kind of the meat of the game, which is, like, these little locations with these little jobs. And we're going to just go take these dudes out and, you know... Oh, that guy almost hit me. There's, there's a number of ways to navigate through this world. What I've found is one of the best ways is just on foot. Like, honestly, it'll work most of the time. Okay, what have we hey, got here? Got a simple clean cut gig. Need you to zero someone who's been extorting regular hard working folks. Our public enemy's name is Blake, and he is one slippery motherfucker. More info on him and his MO attached. Yeah, so I've got a number of really fancy cybernetics installed. I should probably show you some of my cyberware too, so you can kind of see. I've got a really nice hacking thing, and a couple other fancy ones. Uh, one of them slows down time. Uh, which one is it? Yeah, this one. Right there. The That one serves, slows down time if an enemy is starting to detect us. So we, want, we can use that to be kind of cautious. So we're gonna just honestly destroy these guys. They're gonna not even know it hit them. I'm gonna just start with a ping, just to kind of know what we're dealing with. Okay, that's not so bad. All right, it's so you, yeah. You, as you can see, there's a number of different hacks that you can do a number of different things. We're gonna get a little confused. Kill one of them out right there, which is gonna give me a little bit more power. Yeah, that's two of them dead. That dude kind of stepped out there. Come on, I'll give guy. you a kick. That will probably kill. You ain't seen with these lips. Yeah, that was enough. Didn't need to do anymore. Can I hit them from here? No, I can't. Okay, so I could ping again if I wanted to. There Come is on, let's see what you got. You I'm just kind of blind. And then short you out. That should be enough to take you out, I think. Ooh, we're even getting some crystals on there. Come on out, ass maggot! Are you scared? Oh, I guess there's... Skull bashing time! Okay. They almost saw me there. You gotta get contagion. And short circuit it. The fuck is that, man? You should get out pretty quick. So is your friend? I see damage. Oh, they're outside. Are they like fast, dude? I think they're like kind of dipping around like they're a fast one. Hello, friend. Good luck with this. I'm actually gonna knock you out. <laughs> Are you the, the dude? That's Blake. There's Blake. I just knocked you out. Um, let's just read this. <laughs> okay. Good old cyberpunk. Yeah, I want to be also playing some of the stuff that I think might be a little bit less risque for, you know, YouTube, because there's some, uh, all kinds of, like, sex stuff and like, crazy, like, nudity in this game, so I wanted to be a little bit more cautious about, um, you know, what I'm putting up on the web. Okay, there's also going to be, like, essentially a treasure chest in here, like a hacker treasure chest, and they call it other things, but, um, you'll see what I mean. Oh, I think it's upstairs, because you can see on my mini-map. 
And then it's telling me to leave here, but I don't think I really want to. Oh yeah, this is also how you get a fair amount of money, is just kind of picking up all the junk. Um, now I gotta... See, this is my problem, is that my character is like super weak, so they can't really carry very much, and I just picked up this big old heavy gun. I probably want to sell. Oh, did I get my level up? Did that just happen? Okay. Um, no, I got another perk. Okay. Uh, what do I want? I really like using quick hacks. I really, really do like it. Um, <laughs> make them jump even more. Uh, da -da -da. Oh, I'm gonna do that. That sounds really nice. Being able to just like eliminate them and daisy chain a ton of kills. Oh man, you're gonna be like super hacker. There's other really f fun ways to play. Like I was do doing the um, robotic cybernetic and just like blinding people and then sneaking up on them for a lot of the early game. On this difficulty, man, I gotta say that's that's the way you do it. Okay, here we go. There's there's one of the access terminals. I knew it was up here somewhere. So this is basically how it works. Is like um, I have this many tries or number of slots I can use and clicks, and you start going across and down, and then you go across wherever you put it down. So I want to go for this one because this is the largest reward. So I want IC BD E9, and then maybe two BDs after that. So I'm thinking, like, IC, BD, E9, actually, you know, uh, BDs from there, unfortunately. I could, I, I always get kind of confused on this, so let's just see how this goes, because I know I want this, that, and then, and that's okay, but here's the problem. I don't think, yeah, it restarts it. I thought. So, alright, I don't think I'm gonna get any of it though. No. Unfortunately, I kind of really messed that one up. Yep, okay, whatever. We did get some legendary parts, that's really what I want, because at this point in the game, I want to be able to craft more stuff. Which, if I want to craft, I'm gonna need more hacking robots, basically. I don't know, like, people's, like, credit card information, like, Gives me superpowers or something. No question. That's how it works. I thought there was another one that was outside or something. Any ping from here? Was there this one that there was something where I could see something kind of like that? Oh, there's all kinds of. See, there's tons of ways to enter this location. That's so cool. That's a great way to sneak in and then just mess them up. I like that. I like that a lot. I could have sworn though that there was another one. Right there. On the outside, right there. Oh, from here. Yeah, see, this isn't a terminal. It looks like there's one, like, I don't know, in here or something. Or something. Yeah. So I was seeing something that was kind of like outside of here. Here we go. See, this is what I'm talking about. These are essentially treasure chests for you. It's not messed this up so bad. So I could get BD... IC... 55... And then I'm gonna have to restart. See, I'll also spend more time on this when I'm actually doing this myself. I think I got this though. And I can go like so, and then I got two out of three. If you can get three out of three, that's like amazing. Was there another one that was on the roof? I thought I saw there was like another one on the roof. Yeah. There's. It's the antenna. Okay. That's what I thought. See, these things are a large part of the game for me. I think I got 
a little combo here. Then I can get the 55 and the BD. I go like here. There we go. That worked pretty well. See? Now I get them hacks. Alright, um... Now... I should leave that, and then I... I don't know, I, I don't really want to do that. There's also other actual quests. Maybe I should do an actual quest as well. I kind of wanted to do this quest, so let's, let's make our way over there. Was there um, an item or something? Oh, just half. We're okay. So... Yeah, okay, I got the reward for the, the shark. There is a problem, you got rid of it. I'm happy, the All client's right. even happier. Good work, V. Here's, the, here's one of my favorite parts of the game. Check this out. I got a little friendly bike. It comes to you. It like totally just like will come to you and then will like honk at you. And it, it actually has like a fair amount of personality to it. So it. Ah! Oh, actually, I just committed a crime, apparently. I kind of want to go there to my right. Or no, I don't think I... Get out of here. This is going to have to be ugly. Can I get away from the police? Hey V, the NCPD got a call Ooh, about a cyber, cyber psycho and actually sent a patrol this time. But it's been a few hours with no report. Back. Either those cops got scared and bounced, or... Anyway, could you check it out for me? Oh, Much Cyber Psychos are, like, actually really legit quests. They're kind of tricky to see why, but I kind of want to do this. It's worth it. Trust me. Okay, they're actually on top of the bridge. Oh, tricky, tricky. Okay, I gotta get on top of that bridge. I think I can do that from here. I might not be able to, though. It's like dying light almost, you know. You gotta get that parkour going. Nope, that's not gonna happen. I think I can get on top of it over here or something. Maybe this is just like the world's worst, worst way of getting to this quest location. Maybe if I... Yeah, I can't climb on top of this, can I? Oh, I can. Sweet. This game actually lets you do a lot like that. Oh my gosh, the physics gets a little wonky though, from time to time. Okay, so what do we got here? Okay! Terrorist activity detected! Oh fuck! Oh jeez. We got a sniper. We got a sniper? Oh jeez. Oh man. This could be interesting. Can I see them? You can't kill everyone. Oh, what have you got there, buddy? I'm gonna breach your protocol first of all. Oh no. Uh, let's go with that. Okay. Cool. Oh, can I just like reset you? No way. These guys are supposed to be like mini boss battles. That's ridiculous. I'm such a hacker. Is that invasion? Is that it? Oh my gosh! Right. Let's see what's here. <laughs> These guys are like seriously some of the toughest enemies in the game. <laughs> that is amazing. You have no idea how ridiculous that is that we just did that. That easily. Axe. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> oh man. I think I just found like one of the best skills in the game then. That's really what's going on there. Am I still... I'm, I'm pretty close to my carrying capacity. I gotta get rid of more stuff. Either that. Are you kidding me? Why am I carrying around that junk? Yeah, and there's like a bunch of like clothes and stuff that I have here that I don't need. And they don't weigh very much, is the thing. 
these cyber psychos, if you can incapacitate them, like, non-violently, you get this option to investigate them. So, like, yeah, it's, like, really worth it. And you get a ton of cash for it. It's, like, a really nice way of leveling up, actually. Okay. High-caliber wounds, as you would expect. Oh, yeah, there, there was a, a war before this. I don't get the thing about the war. Yeah, here we go. In case you're interested, it's actually pretty cool. There's like a lot of really interesting lore in the game. And there was actually, I think, some sort of conflict like a year ago, like right before this game takes place. So I'm searching for things, I don't know. Okay, vehicle acquired. Okay. Apparently, I got a vehicle. That's weird. I thought Delamain wanted to kill me. I was just going on over to his place to like talk to him about that. There's some sort of hacking computer here. R open. Humane nature. Okay, so we, I think, learned about what's going on. There's some sort of conspiracy about why people are going crazy in the game. And like people aren't really sure. It's kind of cool actually because it's um, riffing off of the um, cyber psychosis from the, the original role playing game. If you're familiar with that, then kudos. You get cool, cool extra bonus points. I'm. I know a little bit about it only because I have been interested in the game, to be honest. I uh, sent the information to Regina, so to do that I have to go to my phone, which is T, then tab open messages, I think. And then you can send this reply by clicking on it, so it's like you're sending her a message. You can actually do like a little text message thing and then she'll get back to you. Okay, cool. And that gets me a couple more points. That didn't level me up, but I, I didn't expect to. I like literally just leveled up. Um, see, these things are like not even worth me doing. You know what I mean? Let's go there. And maybe I can take a shorter way. I like how I got here. Pick up some junk. Mostly so I can sell said junk. Oh, who's this? Hey, I don't think I know you. I'm Claire. Might not remember me. Bartender at the afterlife? Oh, right. Uh-oh. Forgot to close my tab. Bar has a buzz about you lately. As the merc who's reliable, gets things done. And since I need oh, help... cool. Okay. Need a driver for street races. Drop on my auto shop. I'll tell you more. <laughs> Street races in this game. Your garage, where is it? In Arroyo, on Valley. Lovely spot, you can't miss it. Alright, I'll try not to. If I'm not there when you arrive, just hang. I'll show up after my shift at the after. Okay, see you, Claire. You can see the appeal, though, of the game, right? I mean, this is pretty cool. That was seriously the most ridiculous way I've seen... Um, the cyber psychos, psychos gang taken out, just shutting them down like that. It really worked well. I'm just curious, what's the intended way of this? Okay. Oh, I can just like straight up just kill these guys. No idea where I am. He'll never find me. Ah, come on. Just hopped between those two guys a couple times. Those are victims. <laughs> Guess what? Maybe you can just like strip and kill them. That's that's super funny. Anything else? 
Got the cold blooded for that, that's why. Cold blizz when you kill them in succession pretty quickly. It's like the cool perk. The cool perk is really awesome to play with. It's like how you chain up a lot. Man, I don't understand why I can't loot some bodies. There's some glitches there. Automatic like that. Okay, let's see. Can I get him to come here? No. Andrew Dorset. I recognize that name. Isn't this the person that I recognize? Yeah. Yeah, that quest in particular is why I was like, I can't, I can't show <laughs> this game on on my channel. I thought, I mean, most of the game is fine, but that one has a fair amount of nudity and intense like, like gore. You know, it's like they're harvesting people. I don't need this shit today. Okay. Sounds good. Check this out. See that? <laughs> he honks at you. Isn't that cute? Ain't it adorable? You know, I suppose I could take the scenic route and drive all the way over there. Oh, we could go to the, here and just like... I don't know. It makes me nervous. It is kind of like nearby. I feel like the game's telling me to go there. Yeah, it's nearby. Let's go. This man. As you can see, <laughs> the controls are a little wonky with the vehicles. And it's just. It's about there. Oh yeah, also an easter egg I think on here somewhere. Where is it? I've seen people talking about it. Apparently Roach is on here somewhere. I don't see it. I've heard it. Introducing Alois de Can, a deadbeat with a pretentious name. Nice. Gar broke my trust and skipped town. Well, fuck him. Well, yeah. Definitely the wrong person to do that to. Only thing I care about now is the data he left in NC. Specifically, what's on his comp. Okay. Check the attachment, you'll oh, see what to do. Oh, this is the place where they've got the hackers upstairs. I don't think that I can easily get up there, can I? Oh, can I do this? Is that a way to get up there? Or no? This is just ends here, really. Okay, that was worthless. There's a little hacker store upstairs. It's pretty cool. I'm actually gonna go in there just so you can pass you. It's pretty legit. Okay. I need to get the double jump. I'm actually... How much money do I have? Yeah, I'm not too far away from... I think you need 45,000 for that. Hopefully I'll have that for the next time I'm recording some of this. Okay, we're actually on the top floor, which is where I want to be. Right up here. Yeah, right here. Okay. Hello. Check this out. Isn't that like super cool? Like a little store. Just a tiny little store, right? <laughs> Arcade games. Oh wait, what? Hold on. T Bug's death. What did you hear? The truth. Sorry, spoilers. She got burned, like anyone who tries to hit Arasaka. They found the body in her pad. Nervous system fried. You know what that feels like? Hmm. Can't say I do. They say it's like a hundred thousand knives stabbing you at once. I can't imagine a worse way to go. Poor girl. I liked her too. I did too. Yeah, it was that's a pretty sad little moment. Um, so yeah, you can buy little hacks here, and you you can also buy some ingredients. They don't have, like, the super good stuff. Like, I'm actually well above these guys' level. But what I can do is I can sell junk and even guns here. So I'm going to just take a little time to figure out some of the stuff that I don't really need. I think my hacks are heavy hitting enough at this point that I don't need, like, super fancy guns. And see, this is just, like... I'm not going to ever really be able to use that. Um, 
<laughs> all this stuff. The clothes I've been hanging on to because I like don't know if I want to just throw them in my base and then keep like different clothes and check them out at some point. <laughs> lots of lots of stuff, right? Yeah, there's lots of little cool little mods to like items in the game. Okay, I just kind of wanted to do that honestly to lower out some of that. And then see what we can do here. Yeah, the verticality in the game is pretty good actually. Like, it's pretty forgiving to jump between floors like that, even without the the mods, the like mods that like, give you all the special abilities like that. I'm going more for brain modded. See, can I? I can't ping. Why can't I ping? Weird. Yeah, I feel like this is a quest thing that's gonna happen here. Okay, there's a dude there. He's gonna breach your brain. Um, dude, like, oh gosh. So right, there we go. Hang him. It's not so bad. I can handle that very easily. Let's just get them both infected. Should kill them. Or ah! like... That'll kill one. There's the other. See what I mean? You gotta get the hacks, man. Open that. Where'd you go, Blair? There's one down. Just knock you out nice and nice and clean like that. Oh, hello. Where are you, who you saw? Is there still someone alive? Yeah, there's someone still, like, downstairs. Hope you're coming upstairs for me. It's a bad move, man. <laughs> Haven't you realized that, like, everyone else up here is, like, dead? <laughs> yeah, hack ya. I'm gonna get a chance. See, sneaky hacker. so much more fun and it like has the same effect it's non-lethal that's that one I don't know why it's non-lethal but it is okay we got a little treasure chest just want to make sure I didn't yeah and level up good times though right it's fun fun little game okay we can't start with that oh man where's the e9 there's an e9 right there um, let's go. Like that. Yep, we got two of them. It's pretty good. Pretty clean. Um, yeah. Good times, right? Yeah, that's the room that I don't want to go in. <laughs> not, not with YouTube. Okay. Uh, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.